In the fields of engineering and construction, resilience is an objective of design, maintenance and restoration for buildings and infrastructure, as well as communities. It is the ability to absorb or avoid damage without suffering complete failure. A more comprehensive definition is that it is the ability to respond, absorb, and adapt to, as well as recover in a disruptive event. A resilient structure, system, community is expected to be able to resist to an extreme event with minimal damages and functionality disruptions during the event. After the event, it should be able to rapidly recover its functionality similar to or even better than the pre event level. The concept of resilience originated from ecology and then gradually applied to other fields. It is related to that of vulnerability. Both terms are specific to the event perturbation, meaning that a system, infrastructure, community may be more vulnerable or less resilient to one event than another one. However, they are not the same. One obvious difference is that vulnerability focuses on the evaluation of system susceptibility in the pre-event phase, resilience emphasizes the dynamic features in the pre-event, during-event, and post-event phases. Resilience is a multi-facet property, covering four dimensions, technical, organization, social and economic. Therefore, using one metric may not be representative to describe and quantify resilience. In engineering, resilience is characterized by four R's, robustness, redundancy, resourcefulness, and rapidity. Current research studies have developed various ways to quantify resilience from multiple aspects, such as functionality and socioeconomic related aspects. Topic. Functionality related resilience metrics The first influential quantitative resilience metric based on the functionality recovery curve was proposed by Bruno et al., where resilience is quantified as the resilience loss as follows R L equals T 0 T F 100% Minus Q T D T display style R underscore L equals in underscore T underscore zero carrot T underscore F one hundred percent Q T D T where Q T display style Q T is the functionality at time T display style T T zero display style T underscore zero is the time when the event strikes T F display style T underscore F is the time when the functionality full recovers the resilience loss is a metric of a only positive value it has the advantage of being easily generalized to different structures infrastructures and communities this definition assumes that the functionality is 100% pre-event and will eventually be recovered to a full functionality of 100%. This may not be true in practice. A system may be partially functional when a hurricane strikes and may not be fully recovered due to uneconomic cost-benefit ratio. Resilience index is a normalized metric between 0 and 1, computed from the functionality recovery curve. R equals T 0 T H Q T D T T H minus T zero display style R equals frac in underscore T underscore zero carrot T underscore H Q T D T T underscore H T underscore zero where Q T Display style Q T is the functionality at time T display style T T zero display style T underscore zero is the time when the event strikes T H display style T underscore H is the time horizon of interest. Topic. Socioeconomic related resilience metrics Socioeconomic resilience metrics fall into two categories, system-based and capital-based. System-based socioeconomic resilience metrics focus on quantifying the post-event business continuity and operability, whereas capital-based resilience metric measure resilience from the capital of individuals and communities.
Topic See also Urban resilience Topic Notes and references <laughs>